not just about they got funding, it's about that they're showing intent. I mean, yeah. that makes sense. Obviously, if somebody's showing intent to buy something, they're more likely to buy it, it's more predictive, I get that. But doesn't that also mean that it's far less scalable? I mean, there are far fewer people or leads for which that intent data is going to be as rich as you're hoping. And also, uh, you know, it may be much more predictive, but it, it just can lead to far fewer actual customers. Isn't it about taking the intent data and then scaling it up from that? And how do you do that? I love that question because that is the fundamental, what's been broken with the way people have thought about the data they have access to. So we're, we're talking specific, I'm talking specifically B2B. So B2B's intent data, you don't have to have it tied to a lead. If you tie, try to tie it to a person and a lead, you don't have enough data. But when you tie it back to an account and you look at the anonymous data on your website, you look at all your call center data and you look at we have thousands of publisher sites activity data at the account and at the person level on these publisher sites all of a sudden you have exponentially more data than any scraping or crawling of static indicators could ever give to you so it's that intent that actually and that data and it's not about the individual it's about the account first and then go down and say this account is highly likely to buy then who's the right buyer within that account now let's look for the profile the dna of that buyer and it's actually like the web of those buyers combined together, right? It's, it's the multi, it's the buy, the purchasing department that's making this decision together and then figuring out who those people are. But that's the last step. That's kind of the final straw, but everybody's starting there. And that's the wrong starting place. The starting place is at the account with all this anonymous data and external data where you can actually really make those strong predictions.